Hi everyone, thanks for tuning in. Let us learn from number 53. Those who are making efforts to go one step further every day will not go unnoticed. Words for work number 53. Those who are making efforts to go one step further every day will not go unnoticed. Thank you, Lord God. I love these sort of teachings from El Cantare. It's so hopeful. So in other words, what I think Master is saying here is your efforts will never be in vain. Your efforts will never be wasted. Your efforts will never be, never go unnoticed. There are always people watching you. Um, there is a koan seminar called uh, How to Develop Your Destiny. And in one of the koans, Master talks about make efforts when nobody's watching you. Buddha's eye Buddha's eyes are surely watching. Make efforts where nobody's watching. Buddha's eyes are surely watching over you. I love that sentence. If you want to achieve success, let's face it, you have to do what other people aren't doing. You have to be hard on yourself. You have to push yourself to your limits. And you have to surpass and go over and, you know, break through those limits in order to truly accomplish something. Duh, that's the sacrifice for success. And in order to be a hard worker, there's that much effort that needs to put in behind the work. You have to be not just a hard worker, but a mm, studious. You have to study a lot. You have to train yourself a lot. And without that, we will not get promoted and we will not become a person who can help other people. We won't become leaders. Going back to the sentence. So, however, you know, when, you know, going back to the sentence, when we're making efforts, sometimes it's really hard to see the results. It's true, right? We get sick and tired of how stupid we maybe are or uh, how incapable we are or... You know, we sometimes want to end like end up giving up on ourselves because the progress is so little. Uh, in those moments, this is a sentence that I feel as if the Lord has spoken to me, whispered it to me into my ears, and He's speaking directly to me. It's like a gift of words from the Lord, assuring me that no efforts will go, you know, in vain. And so if you're one of those who are working hard, please use this sentence as a reminder that your soul is definitely shining right now and you will achieve your goals for sure. If you don't, as long as you don't give up and keep moving forward. Those are my thoughts. What did you think? Please leave your thoughts in the comment section. Thank you very much and see you again tomorrow.